Hey Bill, Rob and I just got your message that Rob's veneers are almost done. He is so excited <laughs> about it. Oh my God, we can't wait. And I know that you can ship them here to us, but you know what we're thinking? Rob and I were talking. Is it possible? Can you come to Maui and hand deliver Rob's veneers? He has been talking about you so much, and we also know your service levels are unheard of, Bill. So to deliver them would be an honor for us. Good morning. It's early here. Um, it's early because we're not we're not in Texas. We're in, we're in Maui, Hawaii. Um, we're here because we have a different vlog this week. We want to talk about teeth whitening. A year ago, I had a client came to us without contact. Uh, she gave us a review and we turned it into a vlog. Her name's Tina, and she's followed us more of a, as a brand ambassador this whole year. Every time she's always saying good things or telling people which way to go or what to expect or what's realistic, and she's just been a, a, an advocate for us at a time that it helped us a lot. So when we wanted to bring out this new product, we asked her, do you mind if we use your husband to, sh just to introduce this new smile whitening veneer is what we call it because we thought we could design it and give him a shade that's a reflection of who he really is. They're real clients. We didn't pay them for this and they've never seen this results. And I have to tell you, I think a lot of Tina and I hope to meet her husband, Rob, this afternoon. We always talk about smile design, we talk about dental veneers, but we never talk about all being the same thing. I wanted to focus on over 40 executives who want their smile to look really white all the time. I don't think that they should have to worry about wine or cigars or Starbucks coffee, and I think they should have a smile that's predictable. And we've never done this before, but I want you to follow this vlog and see what happens when we take a person who's never seen their smile um, before or after and just introduce a new product that gives him a smile that tells everybody the future of smile design, the future of teeth whitening and the future of dental veneers are all going to be one thing. Let's see how it goes. I remember, and I may be wrong, so don't let me lead down the wrong way, but it seemed like you had a lot of good changes going on right there because it, if I look back a little bit before, you didn't seem as happy as you were, and then you, next thing I know, you go to this really neat little knockout kid. <laughs> Thank you. You see what I'm saying? Thank so like, you. whatever it was, it was a lot of energy. So you always have a trait of energy. Well, you saw the video that I did, that mm -hmm. I sent to you guys, right? So um, my front tooth is capped, mm -hmm. and that was from when I was like five years old. And I never had it, just, I don't know why. And uh, then as I became, as I'm getting older, I'm like a little self-conscious about it. And so every time I would smile, it'd be like, and you were like, I never notice it, you know, it doesn't look bad. I'm like, yes, it does. And so when I came across your site, I thought, oh, I wonder how they're gonna look. And then when I got them, I was like, oh my God, how can you not smile when you have well, a, a sm teeth like this and a smile like this, right? Yeah. Beautiful. I'm guessing we did good on yours the first time. I don't remember. You did great. Oh, yeah. You did good, yeah. Amazing. <laughs> and I just didn't want to go to the dentist. I didn't, they drill your teeth, right? Yeah. And just that one. And it's probably like 50, my dentist said 1,500 bucks for one veneer. One veneer. Yeah. I really wanted. I'm like, I wanted these before we before we went to Mexico. I'm like, I want these in my mouth. I want them for my 50th birthday, and I'm going to make sure that impression's right. <laughs> they look perfect. <laughs> they look really good. Thank you. <laughs> um, so I wanted to do cases for men. If I can put myself in a position to change someone's smile that's over 50, then that resets the ground for everybody who wants to smile. What I did today was make you a set of veneers to see if they can change. The appearance of someone's smile. I'm from England. It could be a challenge. <laughs> yeah. But, but um, you know, I've, it's always hard when you mention something about somebody's profile. Mm. What I'm hoping to do is to be able to take one common denominator out of conversation, which is to, do their teeth age them or does their teeth tell on them? Mm. People start with Starbucks and they end the day with wine, and then and every <laughs> once in a while they have cigars. Yeah. And so how, you you can't be a hypocrite. You, you, you. From bugs from. The Harley. the Harley writing? Yes. And so what's happened is 
they seem to accept that it's just the norm. Mm -hmm. And then we've got the technology that I think is so thin that it doesn't really come down to what you do as part of your daily habits. So many people don't realize that majority of people's teeth won't whiten. Mm -hmm. If not, we would have a line out this door. They mm -hmm. would come in, if you could dip their teeth in white and bring it out, and they stay that color, and could rinse it off and go back to that color. You know, I bet no one ever asked you anything about your teeth. They just look perfect. Yeah, they're like, oh my God, they're so beautiful. If we can do the same thing with with another challenge, then I think then that becomes part of their monthly makeup. You understand, it, because we don't know each other and we, because we barely took an impression, there's always a chance that it doesn't work. What I want to do is I think we just get started. Okay. It's like Christmas. Well, it's kind of like Christmas. <laughs> only, only if it fits. <laughs> wow, so look at those. Sense. But it's super thin, mm -hmm. and it's an aggressive shading. It's for high-end people. If you're not in a position where you're wearing executive tie or something like that, then it's designed to reflect light off dark, off dark colors, mm. which is what most men do, and it carries that look. And I think we start with the top. If you can drive, we'll see. Wow. Start the front, then push the back. Yes. Oh my <laughs> God, he looks so different. Let's see, let's see what we got here. <laughs> let me see what we got. Oh my God, nice. let me see. That was very natural, but let me tell you, exactly. it changes the speech a little bit. <laughs> but you've never had him on. Never. You, no, so, not, no, you yeah. get used to him, yeah. Um, what I will tell you is you did exactly what we hoped you would do. Not try to do a big smile, not try to do anything you normally do. You wouldn't walk around going, oh, smile big. But I'm telling you, from, from two feet away, a half smile that I see, those teeth look perfect from this down. And in general conversation, they'll say they're absolutely perfect. Really? It's gonna come down to whether they're wow, whether you're used to this white. Oh my god. For for 90% of America, they're too white. But I will tell you, from an executive in a nice tie with the with good cuff links and uh, with the right shoes, then nothing's too white mm -hmm. if you can pull it off. Wow. Oh my god. Amazing. <laughs> what is that? Considering you normally don't smile that big anyway, yeah. it looks perfect. So they're amazing. They look, yeah, they are absolutely. My word. They are perfect. Incredible. We're going to try to see at the bottom. We don't know if we, we have see. the bottom yet. Okay. These are, obviously, you're going to have two foreign objects in your mouth at the same time. Mm -hmm. It takes some while to get used to. So let's see what we got. Okay. Wow, what a fat. Let me see. Mm -hmm. It was a big challenge. Wow. It was a big challenge. When we got your model, we didn't know if it was going to be a perfect fit. In fact, I think one time we asked you to redo them. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Them. yeah. Um, and we, we probably would have made some suggestions, but it was so close, it was right there on the fence. And we had to make a decision. Do we go to Maui with these? And you said, if it doesn't work, me and you'll just do a blog. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Like, yeah. if it doesn't work, we'll just yeah. stop and start the blog over. I'm watching the light reflect off the room. Let's see. And they are the most perfect God. smile I've seen. No, you're totally a movie star. Oh, that's realistic, isn't it? I know. Smile. Look at that smile. If I didn't know you, I'd go, holy God, look you at would? his teeth. Yeah. <laughs> it, one of the things that it mean the world to me is everybody says they talk about all the possibilities in the future and maybe one day. And the biggest thing about the future is about time. And we always tell them it's about time now. Mm. You know, I don't want to meet you three years from now or two years from now and say, I wish I would have done that. Even though you're around it every day and you're around the people that see that you, you see that it's made a change, you still weren't going to say it was time for me to see if that works for me. But I tell you, a hundred people see this say, if he did it, that man can afford anything. I can only afford a few things. I'm going to take mm. advantages. We always tell them that life's about mm -hmm. advantages. But the it future, is. so the future is about a lot of things. What I always like to tell them is it's, it's about now. It's really about time. It's about time. It's about time the technology got available. It's about time someone made it affordable. It's about time that it becomes a choice that doesn't include 20 grand at a dentist. Mm -hmm. So when you go, what's it about? What's the future about? What's dental veneers about? What's teeth whitening about? If I was to ask one thing to be heard, I'd say it's about time. It's about now. Because me and you would agree that it's about time we, we let Rob consider this. Absolutely. And you go, well, it's about time we try this. And I think the future is about time. And meaning, it's just about time that we have somebody we can trust, some product we can go to. It's about time that there's a product that'll make a difference. If I can make a difference in your life, imagine how many guys are getting started yeah. with the first sales job. 
Well, I'm 66, but I feel younger than Tina. <laughs> you'll be 67. In, you'll be 67 in February. I'm able to see the smile from all points, and my job is to see whether we did a good job. Yeah. And I think we did our job. Yeah. I think we did good. Uh, this is your anniversary. Yes, it is. I would like, if you don't mind, link your links down below so they can touch base with you from time to time. They're going to ask a million questions. We'll be the ambassadors for your company. Thank you very much. Thank you, Morris. Already know. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Boom. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so Excuse much. It. Let's wrap it up. guys. Rob and I are just so incredibly grateful, grateful, grateful for our incredible smile. Look at this smile. <laughs> Look at his smile. Rob can't stop smiling. He is, his whole demeanor, his, like, he's just like, I want to go somewhere. I want to go somewhere. I want to show these off. I want to show these off. Um, you guys really transform lives. You know that? Do a great, great job. Thank you so much. We are, again, beyond grateful, and I just wanted to say, honestly, from the bottom of our hearts, that you guys have made our seventh wedding anniversary yeah. more special. More special. <laughs> Look at the smile, I love it. <laughs> um, more special than you can ever imagine. So, and Bill, honestly, when I first walked into that room and I saw you, it was like, meeting a movie star. I don't know how else to describe it because I've seen you on social media, I've seen you do incredible work and I've explained to Rob so many times about you and your company and you know on Instagram, oh look at these smiles, look at everything that he's transformed on you know people, people from across the world. You're so kind and you're so generous. You know as a newbie in the Brighter Image Lab family I must tell you if anybody's thinking about it do it now. Now is your time. Don't delay. This is the time to make a decision. I think these are wonderful. As I said, you know, Bill and all the team, you guys transform lives. Pretty amazing. It's the best seventh wedding anniversary gift we could have ever expected. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Mahalo from Matt Mahalo. Bowie.